Hi, welcome back to my channel. My name's Kate. Today I'm going to do a get ready with me. It's the first time I'm doing this and I'm kind of nervous, so we'll just see how this goes. Okay, I've already primed my eyes and done my brows off the camera just because it takes so long to do my brows. So I'm going to go in, I'm going to be using my Pan Art palette for 2019. Um, it's quite neutral, though there is a couple of purples and a pink there. So here goes. just pop in this colour and the crease. So how are we all today? Up to anything exciting? I have been awake most of the night. Um, I don't sleep very well. And the best of times, but last night was a shocking night's sleep, so I need this makeup because of this. Okay. I think I'm going to go in this dark purple colour down here. Well, it's blacky purple colour, I think. Yeah. Whatever it is, we'll give it a try. Eh? Just taking this on the outside corner. By no means a makeup artist, I just enjoy makeup. So don't expect this look to be anything spectacular. Okay, let's see one other eye. So do you have snow wherever you are? We've got some snow on the ground, not a lot. Um, seen it worse. This is the first lot of snow we've had this winter. So we're not doing too badly I suppose. Just get a pocket brush with nothing on it to blend that out. Make sure there's no harsh lines. Okay. Um, I think, I think, I think. Might actually my new Super Shock Shadows. This is the first time ever using it in a pot. Um, so I'll do some more on my eye first and then darken up a little bit more. Dark, I'm not quite sure you can see that it's purple. But. I do not know what possessed me to do this, but hey. Why is it one eye goes better than the other? So it's slow, every time. Darken this side up a wee bit more because the other eye is a lot darker than this one. Okay, now I'm going to go in with Super Shock Shadow in Frog. Here. So I'm going to spray it just I think that's almost done. Okay, let's go. Okay. 
What do you think of this Super Shock Shadows? As I say, this is my first time um, using them. Because Colour Pop, they used to send to the UK, but it would be the case of we would get charged commission. Um, commission. I keep calling it commission, it's not commission. Customs. When it arrived into our country, if it was over. I think it was £15. But of course, if you order over a certain amount online anyway, it's free shipping. So, rather than us paying extra for it. So, um, now they do it that you pay VAT at the checkout. So we don't have to go through customs anymore because they've taken care of that. Um, at the checkout, so it's much better. So I did place a order. Um, let's take this brush and get a wee bit of the brush and just make sure all those edges look okay. It's very dark out there today. Sorry if the lighting's a bit off. There we go. I'm going to go off camera and do my liner and I'll be back in a in a flash. That's me right now. Okay, next I'm going to move into the primer and this is one of the samples that I'm trying to use up. It's Natural Radiance Base Lumiere MAC Prep and Prime. Um, there shouldn't be a lot left in here but it seems to uh, Last longer than I thought. <laughs> so that's fine. There we go. And for my foundation I am going to be using one that's in my project pan and it's a the ordinary serum foundation. Um, it's actually got sleek life proof in it as well because um, they were both in my previous project pan but I thought I'd just mix them all together because it, it, they're both quite watery you can probably hear it. Um, I'm in this colour 1.2N or that is the colour that my daughter bought for me. I forgot to wet my beauty blender. I will be just sorry about that. That's my it's not a beauty blender, it's a beauty sponge. It's um wheel techniques. Okay, so here it goes. I'm just soaking it all up today. Check in my little mirror. Check if I need concealer anywhere. Don't think it's too bad today, actually. We will leave it at that. Okay. Oh, 
Okay, now I'm going to use my Freedom Pro Contour Kit. It's in Project Pan. So if we use that. Just take whatever's left on my brush and wipe that down there. Um, next, I'm going into this cool face palette. It's got blush, bronzer, and a highlighter in it. Under there, and then new brush, and use the the blusher. Got this in a swap box a while back. Um, I love it. It's the first product ever used of Cole. As far as I'm aware, it's a Canadian brand. I do believe. Give my my face a spritz. Let's see for all that's left in this. Okay, and then I've got my handy cam. I love this thing. Dry it off a bit, and then go in with my highlighter from the same cool set as well. I'm going to take some of this powder and dab it on all over. My eyes watering already. Every time, just need some more mascara dried before it started. Okay, put all these brushes in. I think it's 
time to wash some. I've still got plenty on the other side that's clean, but... Ah, well. Right. I'm going to take the next uh, lip liner in... I think it's peekaboo nude. Yeah, peekaboo nude. That's the colour there. That will do. There. And I'm going to go in with the tiniest little lipstick that I have. And it's the Bare Minerals Gin Nude. And I think it's in Darling. Darling, Darling, however you want to say it. That's that. Tiny. I'm trying to use this up for my one of my project pans. It's surprising how much is in this little container. This is the little applicator that comes out of it. It's tiny. It's smaller than my pinky, but still there is loads of product in this little container. It's just, it's not giving up. There we go, that is me all done. So that's my first get ready with me. I'll um quite a dark look today. Which I don't usually do, but hey, the colours in the palette have to be used up for fun that palette, so not like I'm going anywhere today, it's an inside day today. Get my fringe back, that's better. Before it stays in the one place. <laughs> okay. If you have any hints or tips on how to do your makeup, then feel free to pop them down below. As I said, this is the first time I've ever done a Get Ready With Me. I'm crabbing it. I'm actually thinking have I done everything I'm supposed to do for, with, for my makeup, but I think so. <laughs> okay, I hope you all have a fantastic rest of your day. And don't forget to hit the sus subscribe button if you want to see more from me. Um, if you've used any of the products that I've used here, or if you want to tell me what products you think's best, um, you know, what products are your favourites that you would suggest that I use, I'll be quite happy to have a chat away with you down below. Okay, thank you for watching today. Bye bye now.